Hi there. Do you have a smartphone? Do you have a Google account? Or are you willing to make one? If so, you have all you need to humanize your student's remote learning experience. Here are a few tips to get you started. Your students want to see you, so avoid standing with a light source behind you. Watch how things change when that light source is in front of your face. Don't try to be perfect. You know why? Because you're human and so are your students. <laughs> Don't hold your phone like this. Hold it like this instead. Don't be afraid to be a little bit more human and show aspects of your non-academic side because it will only make you more relatable to your students. Make eye contact with your students. This is something I have to continually work on. I always have a tendency of looking over here on my phone, but the camera is actually over there. And when you look right at the camera, it makes a difference because you look into the eyes of your students. If you wanna continue doing video and getting better, it's recommended that you get a little phone tripod. I'm gonna show you what I just did to record a video that I just made. See that funny looking bendy thing? That's a flexible tripod. And I tied that around an umbrella in my backyard and put my phone in it, which allows me to speak without holding my phone and it keeps it more steady. And you know what? This is the hardest part. Accept your imperfections. You may feel the desire to re-record over and over and over again until everything's perfect, but you know what? A little bit of wind might come along and make some noise or your dog might start barking in the background or your kid's gonna run around your legs. And all of that's just gonna make you more real.